Hi, my name is Winston Gao. I'm an inventor, researcher in the field of agriculture, water, and soil-based microorganisms. Today, we're going to talk about chlorine and various different chlorine compounds that the city uses to clean up the water. Now, chlorine isn't the only choice that the city can use. They could use hydrogen peroxide, they could use ozone, Basically, you could do the ozone aspects of cleaning up the water. But why do they use chlorine? It's a choice. No other reason. It's simply a choice. And why are some of us so frothing at the mouth, disliking chlorine? Well, it too is a very simple viewpoint. Naturally, there's three to 5,000 different kinds of organic compounds in the water. That means plant juice, bug juices, they naturally occur in the water. They're not toxic, they're not harmful. But when you mix them with chlorine, they form chloroorganics. These are known or suspected carcinogens. That alone should give you an idea why we who do not want chlorine in our water or the usage of chlorine as a disinfectant, as a choice, are complaining about chlorine. That's the reason, okay? Now, chlorine actually is not hard to remove from the water. Just a run-of-the-mill carbon filter will take chlorine out. But when they start doing chloramines, which is they're shooting chlorine in the water, 24 inches down the line, they shoot in ammonia. That's right, ammonia. Most housewives know, don't mix chlorine with ammonia because you make nerve gas. Evidently, the city hasn't learned how to do that. So they go ahead and shoot ammonia down, and they make a variety of different kinds of chloramines, plural. And these chloramines are very difficult to take out. You need big carbon fields, not small ones. You need bone charcoal, you need activated charcoal, and you need a large volume. So this is my primary reason why I would not want to use chloramines. The other thing is, when you drink a glass of chloramine water or a glass of chlorine water, you actually have your liver, your kidneys, your spleen to filter the water out. On the other hand, if you took a nice hot shower or a hot bath, your pores are nice and open, the water comes into your body, it directly absorbs into your skin, it directly goes into your bloodstream without the kidney, liver, spleen, etc. In other words, drinking a glass of chlorinated water is far less toxic than taking a 15-minute shower. Think about it. Do you want to use chlorine as a disinfectant method? Do you want to consider Maybe you should have a whole house water filtration system to protect your skin so that you do not absorb chlorine into your body. What do you think? We also have phenomenal probiotic products made with our ideal earth water. For more information, please call us at 727-447-2344 or email us at info at gobeyondorganic.com or you may go directly to our website www.idealearthwater.com or www.turbochargedturmeric.com You can also order any of our products by calling us, emailing us, or directly on our website via our shopping cart. Thank you very much for listening.